Um, so the question was about getting into Lee's backstory and what her issues were around trust and kind of how she maybe got to the place where we meet her in this film. <coughs> maybe Mary Ellen, Melissa, you could both answer that a little yeah, bit. Yeah, um, you know, the script, Jeff Witte and Nicole Hollis Center wrote the script and the, there were many versions of the script, but it was based on her memoir. So it was really focused on this one period of her life, which was these forgeries, which she believed, I think, in many ways, were some of her best work. Um, and so we never viewed it as like a biopic of Lee Israel. It really wasn't. It was much more a, a focus on this, this period of her life. And I like when movies kind of just throw you in and you have to figure out why someone is the way they are. I feel like that's part of the fun, right? Is sort of bit by bit, I think she starts off with such a hard shell and then slowly we kind of chip away at it and we get to know her and all of the ways in which she's vulnerable and I think it's so much more rewarding to have those things come slowly as you go along rather than just being there on the surface right off the bat. Yeah, I agree with that. I mean, I, I, I look for so many things on Lee and I, from what I've learned, Lee didn't want you to know things uh, about her <laughs> unless she wrote them and so we really had to kind of conjure things and. And I loved how it was laid out, and I always thought it was a bit of a mystery, and again, a bit of a learning exercise for me of like, why is anyone like that? And even if someone is like that on the outside, what I kind of fell in love with Lee about is that she still had this heart in her, she just kept a prickly shell around her, so I don't know, it was, I found it fascinating. Um, there's another, oh, yeah, we can go to the balcony, you're standing up. Can you talk about the music choices of the film? Yes. David Yarnell here gave us a list of songs Lee really loved. And we used that as an inspiration and jumping off point both for all the source music in the movie. She really loved female jazz singers, particularly like Blossom Deary, Jerry mm -hmm. Southern. Um, and our composer used those sort of themes and musical arrangements to kind of try and create a score that was sort of in Lee's world as well. But we love it too, and it's going to come out as an album on vinyl. So you can get it. <laughs> so there's another question from the balcony that I want to get to. Yes, in the middle, go ahead. Um, for all of the actors on stage, maybe we can start with Dolly, and you could each talk a bit about what was the most difficult scene for you to film. Well, I have. First of all, I just had a really nice time, so it wasn't it didn't end up feeling as difficult as it should have. Um, the scene, the dinner scene, just because he didn't want to make it mawkish, um, so maybe there was a feeling of wanting it to be this. I mean, that's not so sad. I've seen this three times. I'm still crying watching this now. But that you, that that it wanted to be this moment where they could have that it could have been the beginning of something so lovely, but that through Anna's sort of naivety <coughs> coming forward to Lee, that Lee had to come back. And so I suppose it was just trying not to do too much or something, trying to make it real without being sappy. Or, I don't know. I know, I was rooting for them, which I know makes me insane because I, I know what happens. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I watch it, I'm like, oh, just kiss her. Kiss her. <laughs> I, I mean, there were, there were so many, I don't know, things can be difficult and then still incredibly rewarding. I still can't watch any, I don't get through the things when uh, Jack gets ill and you know he's ill and we're breaking up. <laughs> I can barely talk about it. Yikes! Uh, yeah, I, get, I still can't. He's, do you like that I won't look at you? <laughs> uh, he's, you know, Richard He. I'm just now thumb jerking at this one. Uh, Richard was so amazing to work with, and, and we filmed that right toward the end, very end of the movie, actually, and that was uh, incredibly difficult, just because I really feel so much for Richard, and I felt like those characters had really fallen in love, so that was tricky, but, but lovely, and I think important.